गुड मॉर्निंग फ्रेंड्स लेट्स टॉक अबाउट डेली कमोडिटी कमेंट्री एंड टेक्निकल लेवल येस्टरडे गोल्ड एंड सिल्वर प्राइज इज करेक्टेड शार्पली गोल्ड करेक्टेड बाय वन पॉइंट फोर सिक्स परसेंट एंड क्लोज एट फोर्टी नाइन थाउजेंड फोर एटी सिल्वर प्राइज इज करेक्टेड बाय टू पॉइंट सिक्स थ्री परसेंट एंड क्लोज एट सिक्सटी थाउजेंड फाइव ट्वेंटी फाइव इन इंटरनेशनल मार्केट गोल्ड इज ट्रेडिंग बिलो फोर मंथ लो लेवल एट एटीन ट्वेंटी फोर डॉलर पर आउंस द ट्रेंड ऑफ गोल्ड एंड सिल्वर आर नेगेटिव ऑन द ऑन द बैक ऑफ इंक्रीज इन ग्लोबल इक्विटी मार्केट एंड डेवलपमेंट ऑफ कोविड नाइन्टीन वैक्सीनेशन दिस विल इम्पैक्ट एज अ लोअर सेफ एवन डिमांड फेड आउट ऑफ द गोल्ड एंड ऑल्सो वी हैव नोटिस दैट शार्प करेक्शन इन द गोल्ड ई टी एफ होल्डिंग्स दिस विल इम्पैक्ट अ नेगेटिव फॉर द गोल्ड फंडेड परस्पेक्टिव गोल्ड सपोर्ट एट फोर्टी एट सेवन हंड्रेड रेजिस्टेंस एट फिफ्टी थाउजेंड सिल्वर सपोर्ट एट फिफ्टी नाइन फोर हंड्रेड रेजिस्टेंस सिक्सटी वन सिक्स हंड्रेड वी आर एक्सपेक्टिंग नेगेटिव ट्रेंड मे कंटिन्यू इन द गोल्ड एंड सिल्वर Now let's talk about the base metal. Yesterday we have noticed that major base metal corrected from higher levels. Copper corrected by zero point sixty percent and closed at five fifty six. Zinc also corrected by two point five zero percent and closed at two one six point six five. Nickel also corrected by point nine four percent. Lead also corrected by one point two nine percent. This was due to the profit booking from the higher levels. However, the trend of base metal are still positive, so we are recommending buy on uh, on the all base metals on a lower levels. However, development development of the coronavirus vaccination will impact uh, as a positive for the base metals. Copper has a strong support at five forty seven, resistance five sixty three. Zinc support at two one two, resistance two two zero. Lead support at one fifty five, resistance one sixty. Aluminium support one fifty nine, resistance one sixty six. Nickel support at double one eight four, resistance one two one eight. The trend of all the base metal are positive, so we recommend buy in the base metals. Now let's talk about the energy segment. Yesterday, uh, crude oil prices. Increase sharply by two point one one percent and closed at thirty one three one nine five. In international market, crude oil is trading around forty three point four zero dollar per barrel. The trend of crude oil is positive on the expectation of increasing demand after the development of the coronavirus vaccination. So this will impact a positive for the crude oil. Crude oil uh, has a strong support. At three zero nine zero, resistance three two nine zero for intraday perspective. So we are recommending buy in the crude oil for intraday. Now let's talk about the natural gas. Yesterday, natural gas prices increased by two point six zero percent and closed at two zero one point one zero. We have noticed that sharp recovery uh, from the lower levels in natural gas on the expectation of increasing demand in winter season. So we are expecting positive trend may continue for intraday perspective. It has a strong support at one ninety three and resistance at two zero nine. So trader can go for buy in the natural gas also. So we hope that you will be benefited from this commentary. Thank you.